Today, we're going to show you how to create a WooCommerce store that manages customer bookings, where customers can book their own appointment times, pay for them online, and then actually manage the res What's up everybody, Paul Hickey here with Data Driven Design. Welcome to the WordPress show. Today, we're going to show you how to create a WooCommerce store that manages customer bookings, where customers can book their own appointment times, pay for them online, and then actually manage the reservations themselves so that the merchant, the store owner, does not have to do any of that. So check this out. We do this using a plugin called WooCommerce Bookings, and I'm going to show you what a basic product looks like. So this is just a basic shell website I set up for today's demo, and you can set the cost on a booking, and you can allow any number of per people, persons, to be part of the reservation. You grab a date and a time slot, and then click Book Now, and it adds it to your cart. Once you check out, you can actually manage your own reservation using your own account. So you essentially are forced to check out either as a member or you can check out as a guest in which you have the ability to manage your bookings. Now, the WordPress website manager on the back end has a log of all the bookings. So you can see customers that have booked in this case on my demo site, rides, but this is great for any type of business that wants to take reservations and allow customers to manage their own reservations. So you can see the booking details. Now it also gives you the ability to export the bookings. So you can see here, um, what we did is we added this other WooCommerce booking export MR plugin that allows you to export your bookings into PDFs, Excel documents, or CSV. So again, you'll get the booking status, whether or not it was canceled by the user or actually fulfilled by the user. Now, as you can see here on this product that I showed you, it's pretty basic. So while it is great to be able to sell a product that is a booking, as the merchant, it's super basic. So the user really only has the ability to check out one product at a time and really see one product at a time. But what if you're, say, a yoga studio or a medical professional taking appointments online, like maybe even a hypnotherapist would be a good example, and you want to do online bookings for people to see what availability you have in a schedule block or in a calendar. So you could be a, a gym selling fitness classes. All of these I think are viable options. Even a restaurant that wants to sell reservations, but show it in a schedule format. There's a plugin that is an add-on to WooCommerce Bookings called WooCommerce Bookings Availability. And it basically extends WooCommerce Bookings functionality from not only being the single product that I'm showing you over here, where you have the ability to make it a bookable product, define the booking duration in fixed blocks or customer defined blocks of different time periods, having the ability to show that it requires a confirmation or can be canceled, when you can cancel it, and all of these different um, booking options. But it gives you the ability to actually display it in a schedule block on your website. So this is what that looks like in terms of displaying the different products that you create in a schedule block, but also even better, the calendar block. So again, if you're maybe a restaurant that wants to show the different availability that you have in a calendar format for reservations, or if you're a fitness gym or really any kind of business, medical professional, even just a regular consultant that wants to book your time and show your availability for the different types of consultant products that you have. Uh, you can display it in a calendar block now if you add WooCommerce Bookings availability to the regular WooCommerce Bookings plugin. So 
I'm a huge fan of this. I highly recommend that you consider WooCommerce with the WooCommerce Bookings add-on and then the WooCommerce Bookings Availability add-on on top of that. Altogether, this is gonna run you, WooCommerce is free. WooCommerce Bookings, I believe is a couple hundred dollars for a single site license. And then you've got the WooCommerce Bookings Availability plugin for an additional $49. Thanks for watching the WordPress show. For more free WordPress tips, go to my website at datadriven.design. And to do business with me, email me directly at paul at datadriven.design. Thanks for watching the WordPress show. Have a great day.